I mean, you, know, you touched a little bit there, man, on the, uh, you know, going home to the kids or whatnot. I mean, I know mm -hmm. you're... I think well, your wife was going through a situation just recently, man. How did that resolve itself? Everything all right now? I'd like to know how you found out. MTV. MTV, what did they say? They said that uh, you were going through something with uh, with your wife. Like, I think she was sick or something like that, right? Yeah, she was sick. Is she all right now? now I'd like to thank Wendy Williams for bringing that to the masses because she didn't have to go on the radio and say that shit. I'd like to keep stuff like that private, but yeah, she was sick. But everything's all right now. Better than what it was. Well, then that's what's up. That's what's up. What it was. That's what's up, man. I know a lot of us go through it. You know what I mean? I be feeling like, yo, that ain't nobody fucking business right there, though. That's the, I'm sorry. That's just how I feel about it and shit. That's her business. She didn't want anybody to know about it. You know what I'm saying? And I respected her wishes right there. So for the media to bring that and put that shit out there like that, I think that shit is mad tacky and disrespectful. Yeah, well, you know, we won't even run that, man, so don't even worry no, about it. No, I can run that. I want that to be, I want that to be ran. I'm talking about as far as the way it was done in the beginning, because she's, she's past all that now. But when okay. it was going on and all that, and people, it was done by, I'm going to give you, Wendy Williams did it. All right, her, she's the one that did it. You can attack me any way you want to. I'm in the entertainment business, but you don't attack my family, man. My wife ain't had nothing to do with that, man. Had all nothing to do with that. You did not have to do that. Her family members didn't even know she was sick. We still live in our same community where we used to live at. The people that lived around us didn't know she was sick, too. You said that shit. And everybody looking at her, staring at her. You know how uncomfortable that makes somebody feel, especially somebody that's going through chemo? Stupid ass bitch. Bad enough she didn't have her hair on her head. You think she wants people staring at her, pointing at her, talking about how sick she is? Nobody knew anything until Wendy Williams said that shit. She hasn't won a lot of fans, man. She doesn't have any fans, and the nah, people that listen to her are just as fucking dumb. Cause the bitch is an idiot, man. She's a fucking idiot, man. It's like she can say whatever she want to say about me. I never call up there for shit. She can say whatever she want to say. But you don't attack my fucking family, man. You gotta be out your fucking mind, lady. For real, you gotta be out your motherfucking mind, man. I ain't no regular okie dope nigga, man. I ain't no insane Justin Timberlake ass nigga, man. Come from Park Hill, Staten Island, Park Hill, nigga. You've been on my block. You know where. You know where I'm from. You've been on my block. He's fucking them little niggas around there. Think I don't know? Snipping blow, sucking these niggas off and shit. I know. Have you want to do it, Wendy? But me, I'm not gonna do it verbally. I'm not gonna come on your little show and try and bark on you and shit like that. Nah, man. I'm a street nigga. You see me?